Hey everybody, Beauty Holic uh, coming to you today with a haul. Um, I got something from Ulta and then I got something from Target as well, I believe. Yeah. So we're going to start with Ulta. Here's my Ulta bag. And I went, I was just shopping. Um, I had actually went, just had left the cemetery from seeing my mom um, before Mother's Day, that Friday before Mother's Day. And so I needed to go shopping after that. So I stopped at uh, Ulta and they had uh, buy two, get one free of the Ulta products. And so I felt that was a good time for me to pick up some foundations and powder and everything, you know, because I've been seeing a lot of good reviews on the Ulta foundation. And so I really wanted to try it. So the two that I got, um, this first one is Ulta Beauty HD Soft Focus Liquid Foundation. It's natural finish, paraben free and oil free. And so this is what that looks like. And this is in the color Deep Cool. So I did test it on my hand and it looks like it's going to be an okay match. But yeah, I have my receipt if it's not. So yeah, this is in Deep Cool. And then I also picked up this one. This is Ulta uh, Demi Matte Foundation. It has S pf of 20 and this is also oil free fragrance free paraben free and it has a pump on it and actually that is what i am wearing today i'm actually doing a another video um first impression on this foundation so um so far it's hanging in there i've had the block once already but I'm still liking it. And then I also got the Ulta Double Duty Wet and Dry Press Powder Foundation. So I guess you can wear it as a powder or a foundation. And I got this in the color dark. And this is what this looks like. It's like that. And I am also wearing a powder as well. And um, to me, everything seems to blend and look very good I like it you know um, I don't think the foundation started kind of the oil started coming through around three and a half to four hours on this foundation here um, and I did have to blot this is what I had to blot so it was it was oily but um, I think if I use maybe mix up some primers use a different primer or something maybe that can help with that but um, I love the application of this foundation and of course there is a there will be a video up about this I don't know which one of these are going to go up first that one or this one but yeah um, I do like this foundation so that's what I got from Ulta so I got two foundations and a powder that time around okay um, from um Target, I got a couple of things from Target because um, I went on two different days and um, I picked up this um, Pixie It's Judy Time um, eye palette. Now when I went the first time I picked up the, um, she has a lip palette and a um, she has a lip palette and a um, eyeshadow palette. And I picked up the lip palette thinking that it was the eyeshadow palette because the colors in there was just so beautiful. And I was like, oh my God, these eyeshadows are so pretty. I got the thing home and it was lip. So I took that back because I don't like lip palettes and all that stuff where you have to use a lip brush and all that because... I'm not going to put this in my purse or put a palette like this in my purse every day to freshen up my lipstick. So I was like, I, I just don't like that. I'd rather just do lipstick or lip gloss or, you know, I, that's, just, that's just me. But, um, okay, so let's see here. So I was excited to try this palette. 
Um, I've seen quite a few, um, if I can get it out, I've seen quite a few, um, and this is what it looks like, uh, reviews on it and people really like it. And the colors are really nice, but I'm thinking this is going to be the last of my um, neutral, buying neutral color palettes because when you start looking at this, all the colors really look the same. When you look at this, I mean, I see colors that are in my Morphe uh, palette. I see colors that are in my Juvia's Place palette. I mean, it, it's, it's neutral is neutral. And you basically are going to be getting the same colors is what I believe. And uh, these colors are very nice, but these are colors that I have. You know, like these two browns down here, I have those. And this right here, I have a color like that on now that I got out of my, um, what is this palette? Let's see. Uh, my Too Faced Peanut Butter Palette. You know, um, I have, it's like I, the only color that I may not have is this one right here. And this one is called Brick. I may not have this one right here, but all these other colors, I have them, you know, but it's a pretty palette. It's a very pretty palette and it is $24.95. It's $24.95. Um, I didn't realize that until I was at the checkout thing and I scanned and I was like, dang, $24, okay. But I went ahead and got it, but I should have known that because the, the lip palette was the same amount too. So, yeah, um, if you have a neutral palette, if you have one, two, or three neutral palettes, you, this is one that you're not going to need, but it's a nice color, and I knew going in, I didn't need this, but I wanted it, you know, I just, I, I, yeah, I, yeah, it'll be easy for traveling, I would rather travel with this than to travel with my Morphe palette, because it's so much bigger, you know, so, I'm not going to swatch anything on it. Um, yeah. But. So yeah. I did get it. And. Uh, they have some real pretty colors on here. Snowflake. Bubbly. Um, it's Mommy's Life. Um, Good Morning. Brick. Honey Bear. Tutu. Getaway. Pink. Dark Chocolate. All Snap. And Night Night. Are some of the colors. So. I mean. Are all the colors. So. It's really pretty. And. Um. And then this is it's Judy. I know y'all seen her on YouTube. Um, yeah, she's she's been on YouTube for a while, doing very well. So yeah, that's that's just awesome. So you know, I try to you know support. You know, so I got that, and then um, I also picked up these. <laughs> I do not need these, but let me tell y'all, these are excellent. These are so good. I am a, and these are limited edition. That means I need to go get me another bag. Um, I love key lime. I love key lime pie. It's like my favorite pie ever. Key lime pie. I love anything key lime. Anything key lime. I love it. So when I saw these cookies, I was like, oh my God, let me get these cookies. And I, I only picked up one, but I should have picked up two. I really should have. But I don't need it. You know what I'm saying? I don't need these cookies. I, you know, I don't. But so I put, I had two. I put one back and so I ended up with one. But this is limited edition and I'm thinking like I may need to go and pick up another one. So I was watching Beauty, Beauty Essentials. Hey girl, and uh, she had showed this bag on her channel that she had got from um, Target. And I saw the bag at Target and they had two colors. They had a gray one and then they had this one, the one I have, this pink one. And which is the one that I think she showed in her video was a pink one. But here it is and this is a really cute bag. And I like the fact that it's a crossbody bag. And I like the fact that if I just wanted to carry it like this, I can. It has two sides to it. It's very um, 
Let's see, can you see in there? It's very thin, so you can't put a lot of stuff in here. It has paper and stuff in here. So it's very, oh, let's see. It's very thin on both sides. Hold on. And, uh, and I'm thinking I should have got the gray one. But I didn't. And I asked my daughter, I was like, and this is what the other side looks like. Can you see that? Let me go this way. Uh, my daughter was like, no, get the pink. And I really don't have anything pink, but I mean, I'm sure to be okay. So it's a real cute bag. And again, it has the, uh, you can wear it crossbody or whatever. And it's just really cute. And I'm trying to go small. It's my thing. And I bought another bag that's similar to this one. That is gray. And I've been loving it. I have been really loving it. So again, this is this one. This one was $29.99. And so I just love this bag. It's really cute. Unique. It's it's cute. I love it. And like, like I said, I'm trying to go smaller. You know, because I have those big, huge Michael Kors purses. And I'm just like, those purses are getting too big. And I, you know, I don't, I'm, yeah. So this is another purse that I got. I got this one here. I actually got this one from TJ Maxx. And this purse was like, oh God, $14.99. This is a really cute bag and you can't put a lot in here, but, um, and that's what I like about it because it's, it's, you know, it's small. And so I am really feeling this bag. I think it's just the cutest thing ever. And I have been really carrying it and it's just a, uh, it has a snap right here in the center. And, you know, it's just a real cute bag. And so, again, it does have straps that you can wear across body as well on this one. And I just love the, the round bottom of it. And it's just really cute. And so, my husband went for, uh, and went and got me something for Mother's Day. And uh, he hooked me up. I had a real nice Mother's Day. All my girls got me something really nice. I got some pajama sets. I got candles. They know I love candles. So they really hooked me up on candles. Um, I got money and I got gift cards. And then I got this purse I'm about to show you. And uh, I am really loving this purse. And again, this is a, now this one is a Michael Kors purse. This is what this looks like. And it's small. And this is what I'm going for. This also has straps as well. But this is too big for me to wear crossbody. So I won't be wearing this one crossbody at all. But, um, hold on y'all. This little, okay. Um, this is what it looks like on the inside. It's not big at all. And then on the bottom, it has the little gold stands on the bottom. And then, of course, it has the, you know, its emblem and then the name right here. And it's just really cute. It's just really cute and it's small and I love it. And they also had a black one and I'm thinking about going back and getting the black one, but I may not. I don't know. Because I, I have so many black purses. I'm trying to, you know, get different colors and stuff like that. And so this is one of the ones that I feel that I can, you know... Wear with just about anything if I wanted to. So, I, this, for Mother's Day, this was like my favorite gift of all. I mean, I loved everything I got. I did. But he surprised me with this and I really, really love it. So, okay. So, that is it for my haul this time around. Um, I really appreciate y'all, um, stopping by and spending time with me i really 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 do i love y'all so much mm -hmm. i have my vlog my uh vlog number two video out there now y'all let me just kind of warn you let me throw this out here the video is an hour and eight minutes and i'm very sorry about that but um 
I think it's a good video. It's a lot of chit chatting in there and everything. And then um, I take you to some places and all that kind of stuff. So, you know, just bear with me. You know, that's this is number two. So I'm trying. I'm working on number three now, and I should uh, wrap that up by the end of the week or by this weekend. And uh, I, I'm hoping that it's not going to be that long. I'm going to try to stick to maybe 15 or 20 minutes at the most on my vlogs. Because, yeah, that hour and eight minutes, yeah, y'all may have to kind of fast forward on some stuff. But <laughs> I think it's a good one. I, I had a chance to go back and watch it. And I think it's a pretty good one. So, um, just thank y'all so much for your for your support. I really, really, really appreciate all of y'all's support. Y'all have been hanging in there with me. And I couldn't do this without y'all. Y'all are just awesome, awesome, awesome people. And I just love y'all so much. So thank you so much. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.